Take a deep breath in and out, in and out. See yourself sitting here. And we're going to reach down, down into the earth, down through the floors to the earth below where we're sitting, down around the rocks throughout the soil, down around the boulders, and keep on going down until we reach the bedrock far below us. As we reach the bedrock, we're going to search until we find those pools of water cool, clear waters of chaos far beneath the earth. Once we find those waters, we're going to bring those waters into ourselves. With each and every breath, we'll bring those waters up, bring them up through the floor and into our feet, bring them up into our legs, into our loins. Each and every breath, they come rising further and further into our bellies and into our chests. And with the next breath, they come into our head, and through our arms and our hands, running all the way through our bodies and back into the earth, as if we're a fountain pulling the waters from below and sending it back. Fill yourself with these powers. Immerse yourself. Embrace these powers, these waters from far below. Take of these waters all the energy that you could possibly need. Then we're going to reach up. Reach up through the roofs, up through the clouds, into the sky, to that star directly above your head. And we're going to reach up. We're going to pull down this light from above, the fires from above, the order from above. And we're going to bring that down down into our hands and into our heads. Each and every breath, we bring it down further into our chests and into our bellies, mixing it with the waters from below. Bring it down into our loins and into our legs. Each and every breath, we bring that light further down until it's down into our feet. And with each breath, we pull waters from below. We pull the light from above. We mix them throughout our bodies water and light, fire, mixing throughout us, filling us with the energies of order and chaos, the powers of potential. Take of all these energies, all that you could possibly need. Bring yourself to a point where you feel centered again. Then we're going to ask that you push the waters back down into the ground. Push the light back up into the sky. Keep within yourself all that you need. And know that at any point in the future, if you need these energies, you can always reach down and grab the waters. You can always reach up and grab the fires. They're only a short grab away. But for now, Take a deep breath in and out, in and out. And when you're ready, open your eyes and join us ready for magic. First, we make offerings to the Earth Mother. Great and mighty Earth Mother, you surround us, you support us, you give us sustenance, you give us places to live. Without you, we would not be here for all that you do for us throughout the day. Earth Mother, accept our offerings. We are here to honor the gods. We're here to honor the land spirits. We're here to honor the ancestors. We're here to ask for blessings in return from all the kindred. First, though, let us hallow our hallows. Mighty wells, your waters run deep into the earth and connect us to the lands of the underworlds. To you, we offer you the silver 
we say sacred waters flow within us. And mighty fires you burn and transform and send everything we offer up into the heavens to the realm of the shining ones. We offer you this incense and we say save it fires burn within us. And mighty tree, your roots run deep into the earth, to the land of the ancestors, to the wells far below. And your branches run high into the sky, to the lands of the shining ones. We disperse you, we sense you. We ask, sacred tree, grow within us. And now, in our groves, the light of the waters, the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. Each and every one of our groves, by the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. Gatekeepers all, we call on you once more to aid us as we have so many times before. We ask that you watch over us as we walk your holy roads. We ask that you guide us and protect us as we do our works this evening. And we ask that you take our messages far and wide and that you bring back to us all that we need to hear. Mighty gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Now, gatekeepers, join your magic with mine. Let the well open as a gate to the underworlds. Let the fires open as a gate to the upper worlds. Let the trees open as a pathway between all the worlds, open to our spirits and open to our voices. In my grove and in all of our groves, let the gates be open. First, we offer to the shining ones, gods and goddesses of our days, you who watch over each and every one of us, you who we work with, our patrons and matrons, we offer you welcome. To all of you that are buried in this, or attached to this very earth, you of this land, we offer you welcome. To all of you that watch over us, be you known or unknown to us, we offer you welcome. Come, join us at our fires. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Next, we offer to the land spirits. To your fur, feather, scale, and skin, the animal kin, we offer you welcome. To your leaf and twig and stem and flower, the plant kin, we offer you welcome. To all the unseen and all the names that you go by, be it the Fae, the Elves, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Land spirits, accept our offerings. And shining one, sir, at last we call on the ancestors. Ancestors, you of my direct family, you of each and every one of our direct families, we offer you welcome. You, who we call friends, mentors, inspiration, to all of you that are our chosen family, we offer you welcome. To each and every one of you, that is buried within this very earth where we all sit. We offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fires. Ancestors, accept our offerings. At 
at this point, there are offerings to be made to any of the kindred. Please feel free to make them now. kindred, watch over all those who are suffering through no fault of their own. There are no further offerings. Mighty kindred, we give to you. We ask that we receive blessings in return. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. Now, mighty kindred, we ask, what blessings do we receive? Shining one, what blessings do you give us? Shining ones give us gavo. Partnership and gifts. Land spirits, what blessings do you give us? Give us lagus, waters of emotion. And ancestors, what blessings do you give us? You give us nausies, the need fire. <coughs> I read this as give give emotionally as necessary and you'll get what you need in return i take this this, this as a good omen do we accept this omen we now then ask the mighty kindred to fill these waters fill them with the omens we have just heard fill them with gabo the gifts of partnership from the gods. Fill them with lagus and the emotions of the land spirits. Fill them with nausies and the need fire of the ancestors. May our partnerships lead to what we need. Mighty kindred, fill these waters. Fill them in my cup and fill them in all of our cups. Behold the waters of life. And now we thank all those who have aided us in our works this evening. Mighty ancestors, be you family, be you chosen family, or be you of this very land, for all that you do for us and all that you've done for us. Ancestors, we thank you. And land spirits, be you animal kin, be you plant kin, or be you the unseen kin, for all that you do for us and all that you have done for us. Land spirits, we thank you. And shiny ones, be your matrons and patrons, be you of this very place, or be you unknown to us, for all that you've done for us and all that you do for us. Shining ones, we thank you. And once more, gatekeeper, you have aided us you have opened the ways so that we may receive the messages that we have received. You've brought back what we have needed to hear. You've taken our messages far and wide. For all that you have done for us throughout all these years, for all that you've done for us tonight. Gatekeepers, we thank you. I ask once more that you join your magic with mine in my grove and in all of our groves. The well become but water the fire become but flame, let the tree become but a tree once more. My grove and in all of our groves, let the gates be closed.
And last but not least, Earth Mother, we honor you first and we thank you last. Without you, we would not be here. For all that you do for us throughout the days and out throughout the years, Earth Mother, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace. This right has ended.